It's early morning and Mbulelo Ngelo's brothers stand in shock outside the NUM offices. Police say two assailants first confronted him outside, then the scuffle moved inside and ended in a bloodbath. Another union member is still fighting for his life. Later at Nelo's brother's home, they spoke on condition their identities be concealed. I'm so hurt. His killing has broken my heart. Both these unions need to resolve this and instead just fight for us. It's still volatile at the mine. Ironically, yesterday's shooting took place right next door to a police contact point, but no officers are stationed here. The place was used only as a contact point. That is up to the provincial management and national management to decide as to how to use the station based on the current situation. The National Union of Mine Workers says its members were threatened last year and asked to vacate these premises and now shop steward Mbulelo Ngeto was gunned down. Police say 16 shots were fired and they're looking for two suspects alleged to be linked to the incident. The NUM has asked lawnman bosses for more security for its members. AMCO says it has written a letter to the mine raising the same concerns. Lonman's spokesperson failed to comment on the situation despite several requests from the SABC. Chriselda Lewis, SABC News, Marikana.